Uh, it's been a busy morning. Before we say goodbye, we always like to check in with our field crew. Oh, we got a four box going on. Let's start with, start? Ed, let's go upper left. Ed, you're up first. <laughs> yeah, let's get the bad news out of the way. Uh, we've been at the border all morning talking about the latest numbers because the latest numbers mean the fiscal year ended September 30th. We set a record this year. We set a record last year, but the record set this year is considerable over last year. September 30th, 2,378,000 encounters as opposed to last year's record of 1.7 million arrests. So the situation remains untenable, if you will. And that includes, uh, September, by the way, was a 12% increase in illegal crossings over August. Again, we kept setting records every month, and now we have a record year over a record year of last year. But in September alone, 20 known or suspected terrorists were arrested at the border. And that, for the year, 98 as opposed to 26 over the last five years. So we've got a real bad situation going on, and we're here to document it, guys. All right. right Ed, thank you. Clockwise, Casey McKinnon uh, honing her gardening skills this morning, yes. right, Casey? <laughs> yes, well, good thing they didn't put me to work because I am a plant killer. I can't garden to save my life. I'm at the Second Chance, and we're talking all about the different programs they have for the underserved community um, and the youth specifically. So there's about 10 to 15 members a part of this program. It's an eight-week-long program, and they help the community and give back to them. But I want to talk about a little bit talk a little bit about tomorrow where I will be at the canine training facility and watching the working dogs in action with the officers so we're gonna do that tomorrow for you and they have their canine soiree coming up on Saturday which Lauren you are going to be the MC for and I want to send things over to Allie because Allie I loved your live shot when you kind of just casually kicked the goat away from Sierra <laughs> Oh, no, there's no, there was no harming of the goats. I love goats. It just, you know, you just, you've got to show them who's in charge, Casey. You know, it's that country girl in me. Um, and we're going from you not being able to grow anything, but here, here at the pumpkin station in RB, you can, you can cut the flowers. So let them grow it and then you can come and and cut them so which is exactly i've been cutting a few so uh lauren and paul if you see any good ones they open at 9 a.m use vaseline on your pumpkins and uh it's it's gonna be fun you, how about this one lauren i love it they gave me clippers Thank you. they have them here for you all right oh, nice and water and water and bleach um a solution on the pumpkin to keep them from molding too learning all sorts of things and goats bleat bleat uh, Diane shot a 